This video was made possible by Microsoft, who provided us with a Gears 5 Ultimate Edition code. Jack, you good hauling that phosphorus? <laughs> Glad to hear it. See? He's drawing on you, isn't he? Jack's good people. <laughs> you just filled his small mechanical heart with joy. Thanks for being here, by the way. If you weren't with me, this would be... It would be hard. Wait. Are you thanking me or, or Jack? Jack? I'm sorry, wasn't that clear? <laughs> oh, yeah, that's a good one. Weapon secure. You try. I'm that. All right, another condor wreck. I wonder what we'll score. Let's just keep it quick, okay? I'll take that. Wreckage is pretty spread out. A lot of area to search. This'll Block. work! Block. No, two blocks! Why do you think I said it twice? Oh shit! Reject's pouring out of that car door! Spread out! Give him multiple targets!
for a quick pit stop. Let's get searching. You know what the flock around. Every time a condor goes down, it turns into a goddamn recheck factory. Yeah, well, I never liked DBs much the other way either. I'll take that. Open, please. <laughs> All right. I think we scavenged everything. Come on, then. Back to the skip. I'd say we've done a pretty good job picking through these condors. Sure, but I'd like to get back to finding that Kadar lab. All right, time to go. You know, this ice cliffs of death go. This one's got a nice view at least. Whatever floats your boat, my friend. Something else comes up, which it always does. All right, then. I'll cover driving. Once we get through that ice, getting back up might be tricky. Then I guess we'll have to deal with that. Solid observation. All right, let's get this phosphorus cooking. Phosphorus. Fine, whatever. You said it feeds off oxygen and water. Yeah? Yeah, we're about to expose it to a ton of ice, which is... Oxygen and water. Yeah. Huh. 
It'll be fine. What are you basing that on? Thermodynamics. Reaction kinetics. Somebody want to let me know when this chemistry class is over? It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Come on. Safety first. Our radio tower. Means the lab's not far. Come on. Jack, you good? You, you know you don't have to be honest. Getting in there, not with those turrets in place. That did the trick. Shit. We didn't get all of them. Had to be another generator somewhere. Big difference between this place and New Hope. They weren't worried about getting found. No fake shipping depot in front. Okay. 
stuck me. You're this upset about a pinprick? I have sensitive hands. Proper identification is required for entry. Your entry has been denied. Good day. A uh, what? Niles? Is that you? Proper identification is required for entry. Proper identification. Hey, you can give it a shot. But it's gonna hurt more than you think. that welcome home? Do you really require an explanation? I think I like the gibberish spouting novels more than this cryptic garbage can. Ah, I see you've met my vastly inferior construct at New Hope. What the hell? It's freezing in here. Goodness. Apparently, some of our cryojets are malfunctioning. There must be a fault in our system. You don't say. Of course, we cannot proceed until those cryojets are disabled. Would you mind terribly? Miserable little garbage can, mother... Cryojets are probably powered like the turrets. Let's find a generator. Then let's get back to that garden. Well done. Yeah, Jack's good like that. I've been meaning to reset those cryojets for quite some time. Same as the ones at New Hope. Yeah, I noticed. Ah, yes. My work there began as an effort to cure children ill with rust lung, but it grew into something far more significant. The cog wanted medicine. I gave them gods. Oh well, water under the bridge. shut you down. Why come all the way out here? Our family needed a place to continue our work in solitude. <laughs> no way your family built this alone. I am quite certain you lack the necessary clearances for that information. This next area is quite fascinating. What the hell? The path to every breakthrough is paved with failure. Here are some of our more unstable specimens. This breakthrough of yours, how did you manage it? One of the miners' children, as it happens. She was resistant to aging, disease. We raised her as our own.
You may find this especially interesting. What is it? That is one of our first successful hybrids. Hybrid? You mean a locust? One and the same. In our previous facility, we had problems with genetic stability. The sires were distempered and sterile. A problem for obvious reasons. But the locust were different, highly controllable, the perfect soldiers, and blessedly able to reproduce. What made them different? Their cells. You see, the emulsion miners' children provided a marvelous genetic repository, as did the indigenous creatures of the Hollow. In all of your genetic research, it's in here? Of course. Oh, shit. Hey, hey, Jack, Jack, come here! I need you to download everything off this terminal. Oh, man. I don't think I want to know what any of these file names mean. But when the extent of one very special child's genetic immunity to emotion became clear, our work began to soar. Please, go ahead. That, of course, is Mira. Or as you know her, Queen Mira. You bred her with the sires? Nothing so monstrous. Her stem cells, however, were delightfully complementary to sire DNA. But we underestimated so much. Young Mira's strong maternal feelings, for instance. Let me guess. She led her children to slaughter you all. No, no, no. Well, yes. But I meant her more traditional maternal feelings. For her daughter. Little Raina. Your mother. What? You're lying. I am not. Your mother was born here, and taken from us by her spineless father, thus causing young Mira's unfortunate rebellion. Why are you telling me this? You have so many gifts, you do not yet understand. Hey, what's going on? He will kill you if he knows. They all will. What did you just say? Hey, hey, what are you... Why did you come here with me? What did J.D. tell you? Kate, I am not gonna hurt you. No? Maybe you should. Maybe I should. Hey. That would indeed sever the link between you and the Locust. Now, shut up! I won't let them do to me what they did to my mother. Your mother? And what did they do to your mother? In the hive. They changed her. It killed her. I killed her. But that is the process that allows them to learn, to grow. Without a queen, they remain unguided. See? See? I'm a weapon. No. You're not. Back in the village, when I was inside that snatcher, I was controlling them. What? I think I killed Oscar. Wait a minute. You think? Or you did? I don't know. I don't know. I just... I want it out of my head. I want it to stop. And you're gonna stop it. And if I do not? Then we delete you and destroy every bit of your precious research. Then please, allow me to assist you. And we're supposed to just trust your good word here? You are free to trust or not trust whomever you like. But tell me something. Your mother and the Hive, did she resist? 
Of course she did. So I feared. Young Mira needed no such crude incorporation. Niles, tell me. My grandfather. Who was he? One of my best geneticists. He fled with little Rayna because he no longer believed in our work. Did Mira know where he took her? I told Mira Reyna had perished in the escape attempt. I assumed that would end the matter. I greatly miscalculated. But it appears we have another malfunction. Perhaps you could address it? Right. work turn on you. I choose to view it differently. The Locust longed for independence. Mira showed them the way. I have always been proud of your grandmother. I still am. What the hell is that thing? The matriarch was generated from your grandmother's stem cells and sire DNA. She amplified Mira's ability to communicate with the Locust. This device is where Mira first learned to control her power, but we can also use it to sever your leg, if you choose. So how does it work? By mildly damaging your brain. What? By mildly damaging her brain? Her connection to the Locust is based on a genetic algorithm inside her temporal lobe. Altering that requires anesthesia, you could say. It sounds like a lobotomy. A lobotomy is highly invasive. This is directed. While I work, the matriarch will guide your mind, undetected, to where it must go. Okay, all right. No, 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 no. You are not doing this. I do not trust this can. Then watch him. But I have to do this. I'm losing control. I won't hurt anyone else, understood? Understood.
directions. Okay, okay, I'm here. I'm here. Life. What? It, it wasn't really her, except except it was. Where is he? Emergency shutdown in effect. <laughs> talking about? Later, after we deal with Niles.
down! Watch it! More Lucas! Locked. There's got to be a way to open it. Maybe there's something Jack can do. Jack, see where that leads. <laughs> Damn it! 
Then let's get after Niles. Time to go. Keep after Niles. Come on. Hey, Niles, we're still coming. I really don't think he can hear you. I really don't care. Let's get this open. Looks like he went this way. 
Wait, Jal! There he is! Damn it! Jack! Zap it! <laughs> What has been done cannot be undone. This planet is now theirs. I told you I'd get you. Look out!
Okay, then maybe she'll, I don't know, I mean, help us somehow. She would, if she could. But she's not my mother anymore. Then who is she? Their queen. Come on, time to get out of here. got their queen. And Nas is right about what happens next. We need a new plan. No, we need the old plan. We need the Hammer of Dawn. Oh, thank God. Looks like you need a ride. How'd you find us? You think I'm gonna give you a one-of-a-kind piece of tech without the ability to track it to the center of the planet? Yeah, yeah, fine. And speaking of one-of-a-kinds, help me hook up this skip. You find what you're looking for? Yeah. And now we need to kill it. Is she, you know, all right? Not really. But let me ask you something. How long would it take to get the Hammer of Dawn up and running? Funny you should ask. The data drive you found months ago about the UIR. Yeah? Interesting stuff. Interesting how? You'll see. And lucky for us, I have an old UIR contact. Take us home, Sam. 